ESPN 1420 exclusive here with Raging Cajun outfielder Kenan Fontenot. And, Kenan, would it be fair to say the season for you started off a little bit rough and then finished off really, really hot? Yeah, I mean, you know, I got the, I got the starting job at the beginning of the year. You know, it didn't go the way I wanted it to. And, you know, I mean, that's just the way baseball goes. But, you know, now, I mean, I'm playing all right, you know, doing well, just trying to help the team. Yeah, and Coach Robe always talks about the game paying people off for being patient. Uh, how hard was it for you to be patient whenever you knew things were going to come around, but it just took a little bit of time? Yeah, you know, you know, it's not the easiest thing just sitting after playing for a little bit, but, you know, I just was there for my teammates, you know, just kept working while I waited, like he always says. And, you know, I just tried to be the best teammate I could be. Uh, is it fair to say that your team's definitely playing the best baseball they've been playing all year right now at the end of the year? Uh, yeah, I think, I think we got hot right at the, the right time. You know, we're just going to keep – keep working, keep grinding, and keep doing what we're doing. What was the thing that finally clicked for you whenever you started to really hit the ball? Because the, this back half of the season, you've been really hitting the ball well. Uh, you know, I've just been sticking to my approach, you know, going up there and just seeing, getting my pitch, swinging at it, and it's been falling for me recently. How impressive has it been for all you guys to watch what the pitching staff has done all year long? Because we knew what all the freshman pitchers did last year. They came back. You guys added Nick Lee in. Wyatt's been moving around. Evan Guillory's been in the midweek and in the weekend. How crazy has it been for you guys to see the way they've been adjusting to everything? Oh, you know, our, our pitches are good, man. You know, they come out here, they get their work done, and just there's no – when anybody goes out there, it's always like, oh, here we go. We got confidence in this guy. This guy's going to shut him down. And it's just – it's. It's comforting to have all those kind of guys being just roll in there day in and day out. You guys had to earn everything down the back stretch. You guys had to earn the one seed in the Sun Belt Conference tournament. You did that. You won the championship. You guys had to earn a regional. Now you get to play at home in front of the fans. How rewarding has this whole process been? Because I imagine there's been a kind of a weight on y'all, but you've been dealing with it well. Yeah, I mean, we've, just, we've been working hard, man. You know, this is what we wanted. We wanted to bring a regional back to the tee, you know. It's one more week, you know, and just – yeah, do it for the fans, but we've just been grinding it out, working hard, doing what we do. All right, and one specific question about you and Gunner. You guys both went to Barb. You guys are here now, and it seems like both of you guys kind of step up whenever things get really, really big, really, really tight. Is, is that something you guys have both kind of shared whenever you guys were back playing high school ball? Or I don't know, is there, is there some connection you all have? No, I mean, I mean it's, just, it's just you got you to do, you, you do what you do whenever you know, things get, get tight. You just got to stay calm. And I, I think we do pretty well with that, especially coming from uh, old Glen Jacini. Uh, <laughs> Kenan Fontenot, former Bard player, current Rage Engagement.